Hello, hello and welcome to another Affinity Photo Tutorial. In this video I'm going to show you what's the difference between resizing a document and resizing your canvas. So I've opened an image which is 3290 pixels by 4258. So this is the full resolution of the image. If we go to document, resize document, and let's say I want to resize this one to have the width of 4000 pixels and I'm going to keep the ratio. So this this chain link here is going to make sure that you keep your ratio um, up. I'm going to leave the pixels as the unit. DPI I'm going to leave 240 and resampling I'm going to use by linear resampling and just hit resize. You can see that now my image is 4000 pixels by 5177 which is cool but that mean it resized the image the layer itself right so if we undo it now we are back at the beginning and go document resize canvas use the same option 4000 pixels here and i'm going to use the anchor as a center basically what this is going to do is going to add around my image pixels that will add to 4000 pixels in width, right? And of course, because I'm keeping the ratio, is going to add on top and on the bottom as well. Click resize. You can see that my image remained the same resolution, like 3290 pixels, but now I have a border around my picture which goes from zero to 4,000 pixels here. So that's awesome. And basically this is the difference. If you go and choose resize document, that means you resize the layer as well. So you compress or enlarge your layer. If you go resize canvas, that means you cut your canvas or you add to your canvas. This is in a <laughs> type of analogy. There is another type of resizing which is called resize pixel art document. And this, it's a clever way of resizing a very small image. So let's say you limited, I think Peter McCannon had the, this issue when he took a bunch of photos, JPEG, and at very small resolution. So what he ended up doing is enlarge the images using this kind of software. I'm not saying that he used Affinity. So if you click 2X and go resize, what that did is it took my image and resized it, add more pixels to it in order to have an image that right now it's 8,000 pixels by 10,354, which is amazing. And if we zoom in, you can see that the details are still there, which is amazing. Imagine that you have doubled the size of this photograph. And that's about it. I hope you enjoyed this uh, very quick tutorial. If you liked this video, hit the like button and comment below if you have any more questions regarding Affinity, Lightroom or whatever software do you use. Or if you want me to review some new software, just let me know. And if you're not a subscriber, please consider doing so. I'm trying to upload as much as possible videos like this. Until next time, take care.